Hello everyone and welcome back to another tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you how to create a slideshow for your background or your wallpaper on Windows 11. So as you can see here, I have this nice landscape background right now and I'm going to show you how to get it to uh, every you know few minutes, every 5, 10, 15 minutes, this will change. So you'll have a dynamic background in a sense that it will change every few minutes. And I'm going to show you how to do that now. The first thing that you want to do is go and open up a new web browser on your browser of choice and then just type in free wallpaper. So type in right here where I said free wallpaper downloads and just hit enter or select there. And then you'll see a bunch of different sites that provide free wallpaper downloads. You choose the one you want. Maybe you want technology based themes. Maybe you want cat design, you know, cat pictures, dog pictures, video game. It doesn't matter. Type in whatever design you want, free wallpaper downloads, select the site of choice here, and then just scroll through and see the different wallpapers here and download them. Uh, some of them will be in different sizes, uh, and we'll talk about that at a later date. So what I want you to do now is I want you to just download the files, and if you have a 4K screen or a 1920 by 1080, 1080p uh, size screen, you need to make sure you're downloading stuff that's going to fit your monitor. So that's just a pro tip there. Next, what you want to do is go to your search tab here or search button on the start menu and you want to just search for wallpaper. Go to wallpaper here, start typing it and you'll see something come up that says background image settings. If we click on that, that's going to take us exactly where we need to go. If you want to know how to navigate here from settings, you'll just go to settings, open up the settings app and then just go into the personalization tab here on the left hand sidebar. And then what you're going to want to do is go to right here where it says background image color or slideshow and that's going to take us here where we can edit and make sure we change our background to a revolving slideshow of pictures. So as you can see here you can personalize your background. Currently I have a picture selected. You have a choice of four different options. You can do picture, solid color, which is kind of boring, slideshow, which is what we're doing today, and then Windows Spotlight. We want to select slideshow. So go ahead and select the slideshow option here. And then you're going to need to choose a picture album for that specific slideshow. So this is where um, a little bit of, of kind of know-how comes into play. So go ahead and minimize this uh, box here with your settings, minimize everything. And if we go and hop back over to our browser, we'll see these downloads here at the bottom. Okay, if you don't see the downloads, just open up a new file explorer tab here. And once you've opened up that file explorer tab like I have here, go to where you see downloads, wherever that may be on your machine. And then you'll see something here of the most recent downloads. Make sure you have it's sorted by date modified. That way these will come up at the top here. And as you can see, these are the images that I downloaded from my web browser that I want to use for my slideshow. So make sure you know where they are. What I like to do is create a folder on my computer where I know that it is, but it's not going to be in my way. So right here under my main file folder here, I'm going to right click and I'm going to actually create a new folder by going to new folder and then just title this folder wallpaper. As you see, I've done that now. So we'll go ahead and title that, you know, folder wallpaper and then go back to our downloads where we have selected and go ahead and just hit shift click to go from the start to the end of where you've downloaded these pictures and then just click and hold and drag these over to whatever folder that you just created. So for me, it's going to be here and I'm going to select them once more and then just move them over to my wallpaper folder. Now if we hop back over to our settings here where we are creating our slideshow, We'll go right here where it says choose a picture album for a slideshow. What you'll want to do is go to browse, find or locate that folder on your computer. So we're going to go back to where I know that folder is, which is right here. And we're going to just select the folder. You don't want to double click and go into the folder. You just want to select that specific folder where all of the images are. And then once you've done that, go to choose this folder. And now as you can see, that's going to be the folder where the pictures are pulled from. The beauty of this is ever so often you can add new pictures to that folder and you don't have to come back here. Those new pictures will be presented as long as they're in the correct format, uh, which for Windows, you can just Google correct format for wallpaper images. Uh, I believe it's like JPEG, PNG. There, there's a couple that you can use. Just Google that to make sure you have the right format. Now, where it says change picture every, 10 minutes, you can change the picture every minute, you can change it every 10 minutes, you can change it every day. This is all up to you. We're going to change it every minute. 
again, just to show you what it does. Shuffle the picture order. This is going to be randomized. That way the pictures aren't always in a specific order. I like to turn that on. And then a very important option here where it says choose a fit for your desktop image. I like to choose fill, uh, but you can choose fit, stretch, title, center, or span. Check the one that works best for you. I found that fill looks the best with the most images. Uh, if I go to fit, it oftentimes crops it out. If I go to stretch, it looks very skewed. Uh, and title and center and span just don't work for me. So fill works the best in my opinion. Again, choose the one that works best for you. Now, if we close out of our settings, close out of our folders and all the browsers that we have, you can see here is that new image that's in my folder. And every 60 seconds, every minute, this is going to change. If you want to force a change quicker than the allotted time you put into your slideshow, you can just right click here. And once you've right clicked, you can actually go to next desktop background. And because I have two monitors here, uh, it actually takes a couple of seconds, or sometimes I even have to click that twice in order for that to go into effect. So that is how you create a slideshow wallpaper in Windows 11. If you have any questions about how to do this, please put those in the comment section below, and I will see you guys in the next tutorial.